hello, hello. I have a nighttime Dollar Tree haul for you. Um, this is really a run. I have some pictures to attach of what's inside the store that I did not purchase. Um, this is something that I have never, ever, ever seen anybody haul so far. And I will be the first. Um, I thought these were really, really cute. This looks like something that you could hang your keys on. This one says blessed and thankful. And it has either the hook for the nails or the string that you can hang this on. That's really, really cute to put by your front door or where you store your keys. And I like this one. Our nest is best. They did have one that says faith, family, and friends. And one that said welcome home my little rainbow clear frames um, I only found one of these and I was looking for another one because this is really really cool check out this pineapple um, cup it's hard plastic but this would be nice to make a summer beverage in a pina colada um, a painkiller which is a drink that I loved that I had in the Virgin Islands, which I'm going to learn how to make. This would be perfect to serve that with. Put a slice of pineapple, a cherry on top, an orange slice, whatever your fruit is. I thought this was really cute, but I only found one, so I did pick it up. I did find the uh, bathroom accessories. That was on my wish list item. I got dark gray because my bathroom is gray and this says lather rinse repeat okay um, I'm probably gonna add some bling to this part because you know I'm a little extra but I thought this was a really good deal they did have the soap dish but I don't really use bars of soap like that um, if you do I'm sorry it's noisy let me roll the window up um, I don't you know what I mean so I um I only got this okay in the last time I had this somebody I don't want to name names I don't know who knocked it down and did not say nothing and I could not understand why it was always soap residue that was because it was cracked so listen it's a dollar but look at this this is good quality for a dollar again as I will say it again if you know somebody moving in an apartment they had the toothbrush holders they had this they had the soap dish you can get them a nice bath set and they even have matching towels okay not the best quality towels but like I said if you want to make a bathroom basket for somebody Dollar Tree I did pick up and you guys know I love Dollar Tree socks I got these for hubby he wears these three pair like I said he eats socks I don't know where his socks go um so three pair for a dollar can't go wrong with that why pay full price for socks I'm so upset. I could not find that book I was looking for. So I guess when I was on vacation, it was released and people bought them. I mean, I guess you never lose hope, but I'm not going to comb Long Island for a book that I might not even read. Um, just not feeling it. I did get this iced tea. Um, I have not drank it, but my son has and my husband has. And why I get it is it's lightly sweet and it has less sugar. It only has four grams of sugar for an eight ounce glass. You might say, well, four grams is a lot. Compared to Snapple and all the other iced teas that might have 30 and 50 grams of sugar per serving, this is pretty good. So I did pick up one container of that to hold me over until I go to the supermarket tomorrow. And what's this? I told you guys about that spray so this is the third one and I only found one okay and this is me going to what how many Dollar Trees have I been to in the last couple of days maybe this is my fifth or sixth Dollar Tree and I have not found these these have been out for a while this is the facial mist I told you it makes me feel refreshed I really like it now this is the coconut aloe vera um, I really like the blueberry bliss I love it. I love all of them, but I'm going to check this one out while I am recording with you guys. If you see these and you, you know, you want a little spritz, get it. First, let me smell it. Okay, it doesn't smell bad. I told you guys, coconut scents, they're kind of, 
iffy with me. Sometimes they, they smell too um, artificial. I'm trying to get this open, y'all, but I don't want to take all y'all time. I mean, they really have these things. Uh, make sure nobody uses them in the store, which nowadays is a good thing because you just don't know with people, sick people out there licking ice cream, urinate. I think one woman, uh, woman, what is she urinating? Or what? I don't know what she did. They're just doing crazy stuff, guys. I can't get this. I need um, a scissor or something, and I don't want to hold the video up. But I love these. I really wanted a spritz, though. It's really addicting. I mean, don't get me wrong. I'm not spritzing all day, but it is. it really is a refreshing. And like I told you guys in the last video, what I do is before I put my primer on, I spray my face because it's moisturize and brighten you. And I really feel a difference. This is really frustrating me, y'all. I'm sorry. I do not want to hold this video up. But it's frustrating me that I can't get this open. So if you do see these, these are definitely worth trying. Oh, my God. This is crazy. I took one on vacation with me. And um, I like it. I can honestly say this is the only Bolero product besides the makeup wipes. I said in the last video that I don't use their products. That's not true. I do love their makeup wipes. Some of their bar soaps I have liked. Um, but as far as the shower gels, the hand lotion. Oh, and I do like their hand soap. I have one by my kitchen sink. Okay. I mean... <laughs> You know what it is with this one? <coughs> you know what it is with this one? It's the coconut scent. This is coconut aloe vera, free of parabens and dyes. I guess I, 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 I don't feel that refreshed. I feel wet. But um, the other ones I like, the blueberry bliss and the pomegranate green tea. I think I just have a thing with coconut, guys. So, I mean... Let's get to the next. Do I got anything else? Yeah, I got some. Uh, um, I did find these clamps, and I needed clamps for a DIY I'm working on at the house. And I went to Walmart, paid four dollars for one clamp. This would have done the trick. Okay, so I just picked these up. These are heavy-duty clamps. You never know. Um, I'm gonna attach some pictures of their um. God, I want to choke. <coughs> I want to attach some pictures of their hardware aisle because they do have some really goods. If you're doing some work around your house, check Dollar Tree out before you even go to Walmart because they have a nice um, hardware section with painting, with brushes, with um, small tools and stuff like that. Just give Dollar Tree a try. People think I'm crazy and they wonder why I go crazy with Dollar Tree because you can find some really good deals there. Now, I gave away a lot of these, okay? Prior to my vacation, I did another spring cleaning. I got rid of six bags of clothes. You know, you lose a couple of pounds and, you know, clothes that then went out of style and, you know, feeling yourself a little bit. I gave away six big bags, of, six big 30 gallon heavy bags of clothes and I gave away a lot of these scarves because you guys know I I go to Dollar Tree all the time and every time I see a pattern I like I would pick one up well I had been looking for these and never seen these so I could not leave these behind okay this is the red and black lumberjack one and this is the black and white ones and you guys know I use these as head scarves I love them um, but I just had too many of them and you know storing these things are not easy um, But you can use these these are the Dollar Tree fashion scarves and trust me. I have a big head So if I can put this on my head So can you I just love them. I just love them Okay I just love them. Okay, you can use them for whatever you want to use them for but I love them. I love them as headscarves, okay? And um, it's up to you what you use them for. You can wear them with an outfit over a sweater. They're nice and light. Or you can use them as headscarves. And like I said, if I can fit them on my head, then you definitely can fit them on your head. Stay tuned, guys, for the pics of what's in store right now. 
I almost bought some fall flowers, but I told you guys I do not need any more fall decor, but these flowers were pretty. I, 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 I had to walk away. I did not find um, the velvet pumpkins I was looking for or the kitchen caddy that I showed you guys or that lamp. I'm still, that sunbeam lamp. If you watch my last Dollar Tree haul, I want that lamp. Of course, I could buy a lamp. For five dollars walmart has those lamps but why if i can get it for a dollar and i want it to put in on my nightstand because that's where i do my makeup i need more lighting in that area it is what it is i mean if i find it i find it it's just i i i feel some items just never make it to new york and i get tired of seeing people haul things and then i get people who watch my videos who say erica i i I never find what you find. I don't know how you found this and, you know, blah, blah, blah. So it is what it is. Maybe when they open the brand new store, they'll save those hot merchandise items. That's why I want to be there for the grand opening. Um, and I'll keep you posted and maybe go live if I can get into the grand opening if I'm not at work. Oh, God, that'll be so sad if I have to work that day. But anyway, I will talk. I might request off. Mm-hmm. Yes, honey, I might request off. I got to be there for the Dollar Tree Grand Opening. Um, I should have gave these shades to my sister. But I thought they were too cute. I wasn't ready to let them go, but they're just not for me. But anyway, um, stay tuned for the pics. And um, let me know what you think. Thanks for watching. Polishes on 